We had to change stores because we can't. Excuse me. Every day is a new day. And I smile in a new way. Every time I get to watch Fam Family. walking together this morning yay which is a good thing except for it's trying to rain on us right now which is not really that good of a thing but might be refreshing might be refreshing i don't know might be like those motivational movies where For your life. people go work out and exercise in the rain and they're like never gonna stop never gonna quit did you just drop your phone yes it's right oh it's no right. you dropped your phone <laughs> that was a close one. I hate that feeling. That's the Face worst feeling. down on the road. Worst feeling ever. <sighs> Can't we just play on the merry-go-round? I'm tired of exercising. <coughs> Only if we do monkey bars. I can't hang on the monkey bars. I can't either. I can sit and spin. That's something I'm good at. Sit and spin. Sitting and spinning. <laughs> Look. There's one of the bunnies. That's not the white one. That's a different one, huh? Yeah. Oh, I actually um, saw the white rabbit it, like it crossed our back fence in their yard when I was driving down that other road. She was just out there eating because her lawn is like that tall. Oh, really? Yeah. She's just She's chowing like, down on oh, the grass. The salad's so good right now. <laughs> We our, haven't caught it. Our salad isn't as good. We're gonna have to keep moving the trap, I think, and rebaiting it because we haven't caught a rabbit in the trap. Yeah, that's true. They're so cute, though. They are it's cute. It's like a little surprise when I come outside. They're fun. Yo, 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 yo! We are headed out to Grandma's house because Grandma and Grandpa have decided to sell their farmhouse. So we are headed out to help clean up and make sure everything's nice and tidy to and take pictures and help them post it. They're gonna post it for sell by owner and see if they can get some bites. Um, I think that house is actually gonna sell really fast because uh, of the size of house. It's like, I think it's over 2,000 square feet and it's like four acres with like a barn and um, a work shed and then another storage shed yeah there's three outbuildings and none of them are huge but they're all nice size and so i think that they're gonna really it's gonna move fast so we're just going to do for sale by owner and see if we can save them some money on real estate commissions so that is where we're headed and we're taking you with us because it's gonna be fun actually the weather stinks today, so we're so happy that we had a wonderful day yesterday because it was so warm and it felt like summer for one day. And we used it and we took full advantage of it and it was like, go us. Somebody doesn't have their seatbelt on, tag. You're guilty little, oh, you put your seatbelt on, missy. We got Dang. all the work done, didn't we, Luke? Yeah. All the works. Oh, look, the invisible Hello. Man, rain the door. Oh, that's so weird. Out. How do you feel about Grandma and Grandpa selling their house? Uh, yeah, right, like you care. I'll, I'll, like you really care. Yes, I do care because I want to live with them. Oh. Doorbell. <laughs> well, when you grow up no, and you wait. become a weird 30 year old, you can live in your grandma's basement. <laughs> Grandma, are you ready to sell your house? Yes, definitely. Grandpa? What? Doorbell. You ready to sell your house? Uh, this mixed this, emotions. Yeah, this neighbor right here is really annoying. Knock, knock. Yeah. <laughs> Keeps ringing your doorbell. Hello. Hello. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> it's always such mixed emotions when you're getting ready to move. It's hard, but they have a sweet house here. I'm sure it'll sell and they'll be able to get something smaller that's more manageable for them. That's the goal. Lunch with grandma and grandpa. He's the luckiest boy ever. What did you order? 
Um, a pizza, a small pizza bomb with pepperoni and cheese and the ranch. The ranch? What is the ranch? It's the ranch what they put in it. No, you don't put ranch in it. You dip it in ranch. Look at all those ranches. Look, this is not a ranch. This, this is fry sauce. Fry sauce. Do you guys know what fry sauce is? Do you? Because in the West, every little diner has it. Fry sauce is mayo and ketchup mixed together into creamy goodness. With a little pickle juice. With a little pickle juice to give it some flavor flavor. And you dip your, they call it fry sauce, but we call it everything sauce. Because we dip, you can dip pizza in it, you can dip a hamburger in it, you can dip fries in it, or an onion ring, or I don't know. Just anything that you want to dip in it. Ice cream. Ice cream? <laughs> nah, we don't dip ice cream in it. I'm a lone wolf. He's a lone wolf. <laughs> just like, just like the book catch it. Oh. Kid is a lone wolf. Oh, stuck wow. Stuck in the wild. Stuck in the Except wild. I'm stuck in the restaurant with a whole bunch of Ready people. to eat french fries here in just a second. <laughs> Basically the same thing. Basically. Did you get enough to eat, mister? I should have a little bit more left. Is your tummy really full? Not yet. <laughs> but a little bit? After this, it's gonna be really full. Cool. Hey guys, I'm actually at work in my work office where I work full time for my work jobby job. And I wanted to show you guys something that I'm doing at my jobby job because I think it's coming together pretty cool. I wanted to see what you guys think. Okay, so this is my laptop and this is my dual monitor and we're redesigning a website and everything here, so don't worry about that. This is the logo for the company that I work for, Outer Sports, that I'm developing. I wanna show you guys, let me show you guys the old logo, first of all, okay? So this is the old logo down here that we've been using, that's been on the website right there. And this is the new one that these elements over here have been, were designed by a graphic designer, these ones here. And then I've cleaned it up and resized it and redone it and redone the colors and stuff to make it a little bit more outdoorsy and I'm modernizing it so it looks a little cooler, but I think it looks really good. And I wanted to know what you guys think. I want, I'm gonna zoom in so you guys see that's kind of a bluish color. This is like a burnt orange color, kind of like a Texas Longhorns kind of earth color. This blue is the same as the snowflake. This uh, burnt orange is the same as the orange here. There's a rooster outside. I don't know if you know that. See, we got chickens outside our work here and a rooster likes to crow. But anyway, yeah, I think this is cool because then we can use the buttons for the different seasons. I just wanted to just kind of show off like what I'm doing for work. And I'm learning how to use Adobe Illustrator, which I've never really used before, which is kind of cool. I like it. It's a lot like Photoshop. Stupid rooster keeps crowing outside. See if I can catch it crowing. Come on, rooster, crow. Crow, you dumb rooster. Crow. There you go. That's what I get to listen to all day in my office at work. Rooster crowing. So when you guys are driving in the car by yourself, do you ever just like express yourself in random ways spontaneously? Maybe. Do you do that, Ginger? Probably. Like, do you ever just like, I'm not talking about like singing songs to the radio, I'm oh, you talking about- like, crap, I'm gonna have a whole conversation about something and it's gonna be really dramatic. No. And I'm gonna yell at somebody alone in the car. No, like there's the one thing, there's like talking to yourself and yelling and stuff like that. What I'm talking about is like irrational. Like if people heard you, they would think that you were schizophrenic or a crazy person. Oh, you mean like, ah! Yeah, like do you ever just go, <laughs> <laughs> right. Do you ever do that in the car? Yeah. What? No. But you, you are so weird. You I do that. Do you just that. did it. You're do with you me. That? It didn't count. Huh? You're with me. It didn't count. I know. It's not as natural. Sometimes when I'm driving in the car and I'm by myself, I make noises. Like what? Sometimes I'll just be sitting there and I'll just go whoop whoop whoop, <laughs> or be like la 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 la, wah, 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 and just like make noise to be making noise because sometimes you gotta let the crazy out. Don't you? Do you guys do that? What do you guys do? I never do that because I have no crazy. <laughs> right. And You're too so... busy letting the crazy out on me. 
<laughs> and you don't have any left. I don't have to wait for when other people are not around. Right. I just let it go. Maybe if you don't let the crazy out in the car when you're by yourself, it's because you're letting it out on other people. Maybe you should check yourself. We're shopping for a wedding present for Carl's nephew. But they're really like quirky and like, I don't they're know. They're fun. They're like. So we don't want to just give them like yeah, a toaster. They're... We want to get them something cool like <laughs> yeah. Minecraft pillowcases or something like that. Something weird, you know, like that. Something that they'll like love forever and it's unique yeah. to them. So we need to find something quirky and weird and kind of cool like that. So we're at the craft store. We might have to make something. Uh, then that could be mm. that. <laughs> What are you thing. saying? That I can't make handmade gifts? I'm not making handmade gifts. <laughs> no. We had to change stores because we can't. Excuse me. Because we can't. We couldn't find something. <laughs> At that other store. <laughs> I just... All right, did you eat something a little goofy today? <laughs> did you go to Taco Bell? We found their wedding present. <laughs> the Despicable Me Fart Blaster. It's the perfect wedding gift for a couple on the go. <laughs> or a couple on the run. <laughs> <laughs> and we also got them an R2D2 piggy bank that we're going to get. It's important to save money. <laughs> I might need to get we're one of these for myself. We're not getting that. Yes, we are. No, we're getting that. We're getting this for the wedding gift. That is so they'll weird. remember it forever. <laughs> and, and they'll always remember us. The rest of the stuff goes bad and you have to replace it. Do you remember who bought us a broom at our wedding? Our toaster? I don't yeah. remember any of that. <laughs> but I would remember the person that got me this. We're totally getting oh this. Oh my gosh. You guys should invite us to your wedding because we give really good <laughs> gifts. Oh, do you get your ball? Did you get your ball for me? You gotta let me have it. <laughs> this is the coolest dog ever. Okay, sit. Good. No, you gotta let me have it though. Let me have it. Sit. Stay. Ha! Ah, I got it. Oh, what are you gonna do now? Whoa! Sit. Ready? Hang on, I gotta switch hands here with the camera. Ready? I've got the ball. I've got the ball ready. Should I do a bouncer or should I just throw it? Ready? That's going to be a bouncer. Go get it! <laughs> Dogs are awesome. Come here! Did you get your ball? You did get your ball. You were successful at being a perfect dog. Good job. That's a good job. Happiest dog I've ever seen. Huh. I wish I was a dog. They don't have any responsibilities or nothing. They just chase the ball. <laughs> you are funny. Darling, let's talk about those shoes. I don't want to talk about my shoes. Oh, high five. <clears throat> Ready, go, run. That's going to take a while. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna have to jump in that water and wash off. <laughs> now we'll just like scoop off the clean stuff off the top. Actually, if you let it dry, it'll just brush off. 